All right, and we're back. Hopefully. So, um, just as I crashed right there, uh, I I had a realization. This, if this is a castle, right? If this building here is a, a giant castle, then it should be the biggest thing around. Yeah. Way to go, Brent. Uh, so if this castle is the focal point of this, and it's a castle, it's going to be giant. Um, so I had these little houses here that are just as big. They're, they're just as big as this thing. And that doesn't make any sense, because they should be way, way smaller. So I've got to find a way to knock them down without... Uh, Now losing the integrity of this picture. Give you a road leading down that way. Give it a little bit more of a, a full city feeling. Maybe even give it a moat. Feelings on the moat? Oh, no, I lost all my viewers. Oh, there they are. There they are. And they're back. they're back. So, feelings on the moat? Yeah, I know. My, my uh, counter just went to zero for some reason. I think it was catching up with the crash that happened. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you did. Thanks. Whatever I want. Okay. I feel all these little background buildings just don't make... They're not that important because they're not the main focus. So I'm just kind of scribbling them in.
All right, let's move on to a third one. I think I've spent too much time on that one. What if the crazy evil castle is on a cliffside? trying to make a subtle arrow with this roof line. I'm kind of blocking you here with this one on this side, keep you from going too far off that way. And I want you to keep focusing on this castle here, so I'm trying to think of ways to keep the roof lines pointing you back up at it. Thanks, man. No, you had it right the t no, first time. in that one too. If 
some ominous looming mountains in the back here. Number four. Careful, I'm about to go off the edge here. You'll notice like the more more of these I do, the more iterations I try. Every time I'm trying something a little bit differently, but uh, I personally feel like they're getting better every time. Yeah, if you set up that stream, it, it's taking your stream. So, like, it's it's if I wanted to make a stream that had your thing and, like, Frank's thing, I'd be fine. But because it's your stream inside of your stream, it's going to be an infinite loop. Does that make sense?
I'm not sure. Um, like I said, I'm going to I'm gonna take a look and do some research tomorrow before we start streaming. And then we'll get it figured out so that we can get it working. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Yeah, go ahead and start streaming. We'll get it figured out for tomorrow. So for this one, I tried to take this from the other angle, from looking from the castle down at the little village. And again, I want I want things to point to this castle, so I'm trying to keep these roads kind of really arrow-like, pointing right at this castle, so your eyes are subconsciously drawn to it. Sorry, as I get more into this, I'm going to have less and less I just think to say. So if there's anything you want to talk about or anything you want to know, like just uh, just hit me up in the comments. It's easier for me to reply to a comment than keep my brain talking while I'm working through these kind of problems.
put a big tree there just so I have some kind of break in the shapes. You know, I had a a big tree in one of the ones I did last week. <laughs> Maybe putting a giant tree in here would uh, help tie those two together. With bodies hanging from the tree. Okay. I mean, they're going to be tiny. You won't be able to see them in, in the picture. But uh, I could definitely go back to that other image and put some, some bodies in there. here because these are going to get really confusing otherwise. dig this one the most so far. It's got a, it's got a really graphic feel for me. Kind of reminds me of some old comics where they have really sharp angles on all the letters and and words that so kind of points you right towards like the dude's fist as it's coming in the middle of the screen or page rather.
if I leave just one tree, that is going to be too much of an anomaly. It's too singular. And I mean, you can see it right here with what I just did. As soon as something is all by itself, that's the only little statue thing that I've got in this whole picture. And all of a sudden, it kind of takes on like a higher importance of itself because it's just by itself, and there's nothing else that's like it. Right now, I'm just kind of erasing these buildings from touching this big castle, so the big castle has a little bit more um, pop out from the page. shouldn't be doing any kind of tonal stuff right now but I think it's gonna help me in the next phase gives me like a really strong graphic punch so I'm just trying to like think about if I want to keep this or if I want to do more Do a couple more just to make sure. This time I'm going to do something other than a castle. Just kind of 
set my mind at ease that that is the the best image for the job. Music's cut out and I didn't even realize it. song. Is this section of the building going to be? You can kind of tell I'm just throwing this building together because this doesn't make any sense. No worries, man.
let's do... Uh, I'm going to do a composition called a steel yard. Basically, you put one big building close up, or just big building on one side, and then off in the other side, you put a little tiny building. It can be a building, it can be a tree. I'm already really liking this one. I'm getting a detail on a quick little sketch. I should not be doing that.
putting this tree shape in here to retain you in the image. don't like it yeah I, I know I need to block you in but I gotta get it with something else I'm starting to repeat my pattern.
kind of liking that. I mean, maybe not the structure so much. Maybe I can make that better. But I like the I like the little winding path that goes down to the castle way off in the distance. And the castle looks giant because we've got a regular building in the front. Let's try that again.
that doesn't make any sense lighting wise so I need to stop trying to pre-light this and just worry about my lighting later
Thanks for joining the stream. Yeah, that's... I think that's actually the one. We're not even gonna write on it. Just give that a check mark, because I really like that one. That one, not so much. Alright. One more, and then. I'll reduce it down to two. So I'm going to try to reverse this one with the steel yard, uh, still the steel yard effect, but I'm going to put the, just jump for this giant castle evil, oh man, I cannot even talk right now. I'm going to put this giant evil castle and its little city all up close to the frame. And then put something off in the distance. Although I already don't feel like this is going to work. Just looks like a big pile right now. Welcome back. Welcome back. <sighs> yeah, no, I'm not liking that one at all. I'm going to just snip that one out. And we'll start that one over again. sometimes hit these points where you've used a lot of your good ideas and you're really trying to keep putting out good ideas but you end up just putting out garbage ever after that after that point you hit
gap to this one. I'm going to narrow it down to the ones I really like. I'm going to call it an evening. I'm starting to starting to run out of steam here. Kind of envisioning a, a little bit of a, a river here or a stream here. Got a couple of bridges. Maybe a couple of little docks. Yeah, I'll definitely be on tomorrow, and I'll work on the whichever ones I decide to go with. By the way, thanks for tuning in, Warfrog. I'm glad you're liking what I'm doing. Take a quick recap and see what we got here.
So these are the eight that I came up with tonight. Of these, the ones I'm really feeling. That one there. Either of those two. You know what? This is not that one, not that one, and not that one. The other ones I all kind of like. Or at least can see the merits of. So we got one, two, three, four, and five. Which two do you think I should keep? Which two are your favorite? Like little dudes on the river, but maybe not to death. Maybe not quite yet with that one. Four and five are really similar. They got like four a little bit better. So I'll put four down here in the running. Man, I like one and two. I think two gives me a little bit more of an ominous feel. So I'm going to do two and four. And that way I don't have to do the internal components of the castle. I can just have the external silhouette and shape of it. Alright, yeah. Two and four. Those will be the ones I work on tomorrow night. I shall see you then. Uh, thanks for tuning in.